swag, 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 swag. Back in this bitch. You already know what it is, man. It's your boy Laid Back. Back in with another reaction, another review, another episode. Turn up! Hey, hey, hey. But anyway, look, we back, man. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. Notifications, all that cool stuff. We back here with another reaction, though. Check this out. We doing something a little different this time. So, DJ Vlad. I know y'all probably heard of him. Real big dude on YouTube or whatever. He was interviewing AR Ab. And what made me click on the interview to actually see what was going on was it say uh, Beans had backstabbed or stabbed Meek Mill in the back. And I was like, whoa. So they going that route. So I clicked on it. And so they started talking about, you know, ARF started talking about how Philly was about to become united. As far as like, you know, everybody doing music together, Meek Mill, Beans, you know, him, a couple of uh, other artists in Philly was going to come together and like work on a, a project of some sort or something like that. So it was like some real high camaraderie going on. And then all of a sudden, you know, the Benny, Benny Siegel thing happened where he kind of, you know, fell out with Meek. Everybody know what happened. He had called. Oh, man, it's a, it's a lot of this shit to get to. So anyway, Benny Siegel was helping Meek Mill write this disc record for the game. They so-called say the next day Benny Siegel was, in a, was on the phone with, with the game and was just bashing Meek Mill. Just so happened, the game recorded B Benny Siegel. The footage was sent to Meek Mill and he heard it. And that's kind of how everything started, you know what I mean? With, you know, the beef and all that type of stuff. But anyway, what happened was, when that went down, it shut everything down with Philly trying to unite. As far as, you know, everybody was coming together, they was trying to trust each other. And that right there was like the ultimate deal breaker for everybody. And so, ARF said he feel like Benny Siegel stabbed Meek Mill in the back. Straight up, like, yeah, he said it. And I, it had me thinking, like, hmm, I wonder what Benny Siegel gonna think about this when he see it. You know what I mean? And even ARA was like, I ain't got no beef with him or nothing like that. I don't have no problems with Beans. It's just, you know, it, it was real nutty. What he did, it was real nutty. Like, that's crazy. So it was it was crazy because to hear, you know, ARF say that, and then you just think about like philly you know they try to support each other and all that type of stuff and then to just see how that happened like it was it was crazy so i had to click on it and see what was going on so also inside of this interview they was talking and vlad asked him a, a hard question even when he asked it i was like oh what 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 is he gonna say what's gonna be the answer and so he basically asked him okay cool you from philly you rep philly inside of philly if Meek Mill threw a show, Lil Uzi threw a show, who would have the biggest turnout? And when he said that, I was like, oh man, that's like a tough one. Like, instantly I started thinking like, uh, I don't even know Meek Mill or Uzi. Uzi red hot right now. Meek Mill been hot for a while though. A long, long while. But anyway, so y'all let me know in the comments below. Who do you think in the process, if they threw a show, Benny Siegel, nah, not Benny Siegel. We all know y'all ain't going to no Benny Siegel show. <laughs> but I'm talking about Meek Mill and I'm talking about Lil Uzi, man. Out of them two guys, who do you think would draw the biggest crowd? Then they took it even further. They said if them dudes was to combine together and throw a show, then we're going to throw PNB Rock on that joint. The whole city is coming out. The whole Philadelphia. If anybody watching this from Philly, you let me know. If these dudes was to put together this super show, how much of Philly would come out? Will it be everybody empty out the crib and putting on their gear, getting fresh, all that, you know what I'm saying? Show it to the joint? Or is some people just going to be like, nah, I ain't messing with it. To be honest, I ain't even from Philly. I've been to Philly a couple times, but I know for a fact if these artists was to come together, put together a show, everybody got to go support because they running, they running it right now for Philly. So shout out to uh, DJ Vlad, man, with this interview. He always getting like some timely stuff. 
he always getting some some controversial stuff too so shout out to him man if y'all haven't checked it out y'all make sure y'all go check out that interview man with ar app um ar rap was just keeping it real what what do you expect he was just keeping it 100 so look man if you haven't make sure you hit that subscribe button make sure you hit that notifications button do all that cool stuff man it's your boy laid back i'm back here another reaction another review salute yeah